YouTube, welcome back to another video today. We are playing more Planet Zoo. As you guys can see, I've been pretty busy with the game playing 60.9 hours all together. And if you guys didn't know already, I have all the DLCs officially. Got the Arctic, the Deluxe, Australia, South America, and Arctic. And I've been pretty busy making a bunch of zoos. Give me one second. I'm looking right, right in my hair. So, so we're playing some more of this game. I'm going to actually make a brand new zoo for this episode, and to show you guys like what, like to show you guys like what I've learned from this game and stuff. So I actually have a lot more zoos than you guys think I do. We just need a new one. We'll do Temperate, North America. I'll call it. Oh, what should we call it? Maybe New York Zoo? Difficulty easy and create zoo. So I've I've what I learned from this game is that you can like make it so then the oh my god what am I thinking? You can make it so that if you put walls up like in the construction tab then you, that's how you make the letters and you put them on like make sort of like sort of signs like and it was a really big surprise to me when I found that out. But just to warn you guys, I might ha leave a little surprise in the end. But first of all, let me go to settings and set the game the way we like it. So we go to animal settings. I'm going to keep fights on and just check all these other ones. I guess, guess just made this to a 10,000. So, I got a few more blueprints that you guys will know. And one of them I'm really happy with. But it's one of them I actually made by myself. I didn't like get it off like the Steam Workshop. But if I go to my blueprints, right here, it's the staff area. And as you guys will see, that is that it is completely filled with a bunch of different natural things. I don't know what you guys would call it. But we're gonna put it so the guests can't see it. May turn it a little so I could easily run a path through there. So that's what I did that actually in a different zoo. I didn't post it on YouTube, so if, once, so if we go to here, and go straight like that, and like that, I think I barely will make it. I actually made the size a little bit smaller, make two, so I can like go straight.
then just curve it around like that and then going off into the distance like so so now let me connect the path to all of the buildings There we go, so now, let's go back to the regular path. I think it's time we make our first enclosure of the zoo. So for the land of blueprints, as you guys will possibly see for the Steam Workshop, I have a bunch, bunches of different things that I got from it. Such as the African Elephant Habitat, and the African wild dog, the Arctic wolf, the meerkat, tigers, I don't know what that is, uh, the camels, cheetahs, the horse wolves, crocodile, uh, elephants, uh, flamingos, uh, hippos, Thing. We'll see. No, that's the hippo. The complete hippo habitat. The whatever that is. Giant pandas, giraffes, and more giraffes, elephant, hyena, uh, jaguar, hippo, more, more hippos, snow leopard, the tortoise, uh, the great apes, the gorillas. Mm, more jaguar. You, you guys get it. I have a bunch of stuff here. What we're going to start with is the polar bears. We're going to start off with the polar bears habitat once we get it. Oh my god. Wait. What? Wait, what am I missing here? This is it. This is a. Oh, okay. I was about to say, bro. That is not what I downloaded. Oh my god. Right there. There we go, the full polar bear exhibit. I'm gonna run a little path going along all the way to there. Then we're gonna have this glorious path run all the way around here. So if, people, if they want to stop by to see the polar bears, they can. This is a really big habitat, guys. Oh, oh my god, it's just a big rectangle. using two. Delete, delete, 
delete, delete. There we go. No, and actually, let me make this a little smaller. What do you say, three? Yeah, that's good. And now we'll just bring this around town. All around the habitat. I literally, I've never seen such a like long enclosure. Usually, I make them like big. They're not long. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna actually make this a normal pass. I'm gonna make it so then the gas can come right back here. So they have a choice if they want to go that way or that way. And so far, I'm actually really surprised with this. Oh my god. I just think it is huge. Don't get me wrong. It is big. But like... You know what I'm going to do? Find the foundation. And I'm going to turn this all back into snow. So now if I go to painting and snow. And then let me actually get, if I go to habitat, I think. I'm pretty sure it's habitat. Yeah, it's habitat, it's habitat. Also, guys, I'm very sorry if this lags, but if it does, I don't, honestly I have no idea like, how to stop it. So then if I go to coolers, cooler, then I'm going to make the range at 20. I'll put like a couple of these down. So if you're walking by, you're going to need a coat of some sort. Now we go to here and make the temperature go down to negative four. And then this one down to negative four. There we go. So that's good for the polar bears, I believe. They aren't. Oh great, please tell me this is an enclosure. Now if I highlight over the barrier, or this, is it gonna say this is an en What the heck is this thing? Highlight all of it, and then change it to glass. Obstructing it, all these things. So you know what we do? Delete. No, there's nothing obstructing it, right? Obstruct. Thick. What is obstructing it? All of it. Just make it all thick glass. Ugh. This is gonna be the death of me. I swear.
Thirty three feet or something. Second guys, I need to just rearrange this back a little. Back to barriers, habitat gate, and add a gate. There we go. Now the polar bears cannot escape. So 
something else quick because I need to go to edit barrier and then make it so then all of them what's it called all of them are thick glass and then oh, what else was I gonna do? And that was actually raise it a little bit. Maybe I could do the there we go. That should be good. Twelve feet. So then any person who is tall can go like that and view it. Same here. You can literally just like go like from here and just see all of them. Because we're going to make a ton, trust me. We're going to make a lot. We're just starting with a polar bear. This isn't going to be like my other videos. Like it's not going to be like hours or like an hour long. I'm going to make a few of them. Like around like maybe like however long this video is. So like once we see the polar bears get put into the exhibits then I will end the video maybe watch them for a little bit and then end the video or something like that but then I'm gonna make another one and you guys are gonna see more than one video today I promise you all that but anyway let me hire some staff that would really help we'll hire like hire like five care caretakers Two, three, four. I should know what to start for. So I have to go back. I'll hire like, I'll hire like three keepers, depending on how fast this goes. You know, I'll hire like six. Four, five, six. Mechanic will hire like two mechanics because these guys I, I don't think we're gonna need. How about two security guards? A vent, uh, like three vendors, maybe for now. Two veterinarians, and one single educator. It's time to go back. that all these buildings are in and then this polar bear enclosure. I'm gonna title it Polar Bear. There you go, polar bears. Now if I go to this animal storage we'll hire like a few more I like the rest of these and then we'll send them all into the enclosure see how long it takes got eight of these things so it'll only take around two trips and the buildings are really close to this habitat so it won't really take that Let's send them into here. And 
and that would speed up the time. That should be them, nope. Here they come. The polar bears, welcome to your habitat. The polar bear hydra. <laughs> There's like like seven of those in there. Here they all go, yay. What is this now? Injury discovered, oh great. That, where's the Oh, it's right there. Now you just get their food and water stuff. And I think we'll be on our way to ending the video. Give me a quick snack. Cool food and water. And fill their species. And then pull over there. Here it is, polar bear, and then, so it has food tray large and food tray small, make one for each, one of each, and there's the vet taking the polar bear to get 